How's it going everybody? Welcome back. It's finally I'm back. Yeah, took like a day off for today since it's a victory day. So today we're gonna play the European War 4 again and after the games end we're gonna have a giveaway so you guys can join whatever you guys want. So for today we're gonna continue the uh, Son of Rome campaign. We have already finished the New World Order. We have already finished Mother Russia. Steel of Diamonds, also the Battle of Empire as well. We only have the Son of Rome and also Wheel of Thrones left. So we're gonna do Son of Rome. Okay, so I think we almost at the end. We just need to finish the Peninsula War. Okay, so it looks like we need just to take out the Portuguese and the Spanish. Okay. We have so many tanks. I don't know why we're so equipped with the Fiat 2000. I mean... Probably the model loves the tank so much that he always put it into the game. We also have a maximum amount of general as well. I think we don't really need a general. I think we don't, right? Who knows? Let's have a look. Let's take that one. Even Graziani cannot take out one small calorie. That is a shame to the Roman Empire, you know? That's a big shame right there. So behave yourself. Nice. So we're gonna take out this tank eventually. We're gonna roll it out. 84 damage, that's pretty much a lot. So yeah, finally took a day off. It was pretty good, just you know, hanging out, going out for some, you know, personal stuff, uh, hanging out with friends, have some cocktails at the bar. Okay, finally back. Now, uh, big problem in Spain. The, the one thing I hate about, most about Spain is the bloody river here. Uh, I will try to get a good glimpse of something else. Let's see, 60 damage. Uh, maybe I can get to Barcelona. Who knows? I think we can. Yes, why not? Let's just take out the forts here. You can tell that even though, even though the forts might look pretty shitty, but the damage is really high. So, yeah. Now, all we need to do is grab some of these, okay? And also take one of the fort as well. I think this guy is specialist at force, right? Yes, he have the geography, also the strike and surprise. Okay, very nice, very good. Nice. Okay, so now we should cross this one. We don't really care about much about the uh, the battleships at Barcelona. We don't really. It doesn't really matter at all. We just need to, you know, take out the forts and take that one out and capture Bilbao. Uh, it's a really strategic area so that we can also stop them from producing artillery. Also, it helps us with uh, many other stuff as well. So we're going to have a lot of episode coming up. We're going to have a lot of uh, easy tech stuff. We're going to have a lot of a mod review as well. Also, uh, uh, the Age of Civilization 2. Uh, we have a lot of challenge to do as well. And yeah, why not? Let's just open a Zaragoza a bit. Just take that some space and get a machine gun. Okay, machine gun. Very nice. Uh, we're gonna take workers and strike the force again. Okay, and turn. Nice, 88. Good. Good, good. Let's just take a uh, bomber. I need a bomber, to be honest. Uh, strike that one. I think we should go really far into the backyard of Spain and go back to Bilbao and get some health for the dude. And we're gonna strike around here. So we're gonna go through Madrid. And so our goal is Madrid and Lisbon. So I will just strike down here to Porto. Okay, so now focus on workers. Very nice, 55 damage. That's pretty much a lot. Uh, I think uh, I think we're, we're losing, right, or something. Why does the morale drop? I don't really understand why. Anyway, let's strike that one. So besides taking on uh, objectives, we need to also take out generals as well, which is gonna be really annoying because th those guys aren't really that easy to be destroyed. So we will try the new way. Very nice. Take out this one. Sixty-seven. Gonna come down and we're gonna strike this one. Siri damage from our bombers, and we're gonna get some infantry to defend. Uh, we will see the next turn. So we're gonna have a bit of a problem right now. So we're gonna take Borgers. Some of those guys have already finished our generals, which is really a bad thing. Oh, 
Okay. Uh, let's take out the big boss. Uh, we're gonna have some fun with him. Okay, 35. Very nice. Okay, another one. 23. What happened? What happened to this dude? What happened to him? 67. That's a lot. Very good. Now, take out this one. 51. Very nice. Uh, but looks like this guy is really buff. Oh my god, 300 health. Uh, we need a bomber, big ass bomber to help us. Okay, things to consider. Take out this guy. 77, very nice. Uh, we're gonna open burgers and also equip some machine gun. I don't really trust this guy, so it's better that we should secure ourselves. 39, very nice. I will get some uh, first aid spark for him. Uh, we can strike Madrid. I think it's better to strike Madrid for now. Uh, if not, then we are we are suffering in a really, really, really bad situation. And turn. Okay. Now, take out this guy, please. 36. I don't know which counters the best. Because looks like I try, but it doesn't really go out well. We might need a few more, you know, turns just to take out these guys out. It's not that easy, though. Okay, let's take Madrid. Okay, I hate the fact that he has some really defensive, you know, kind of skill. Which triggers me a lot. Uh, maybe I can take out the artillery. I don't want to involve with a full frontal assault and Madrid. Okay, so this guy is still alive. 48 damage. Oh my god, still freaking alive. It's not that easy to kill that bastard. Okay, take out this one. 49, so we do this. We split between, between that one, so Graciani can also strike that guy. And we can also land it at Madrid. So that's a good start, very nice. We come back, and this guy's my loss of few health. So let's just strike from here. We will suffer both damage from the south and the northern uh, fort. So we'll try to use our bombers uh, since we have a really far range and strike from behind. We're gonna get another bombers and turn. It's definitely suffering a lot from uh, that point of view. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is uh, it's coming down. 65 damage very nice uh, hopefully this guy will yes he complete that guy very good now strike the forts i hate freaking forts so it's better to take them off as fast as we can very nice okay strike this one here too uh took out that one sorry seven good so now we can reach a far ranges Target, good. So we're gonna get a uh, infantry defend that one. Also, our aircraft will work well. Bombers actually, okay. Strike the forts again. We're gonna get another aircraft. It's gonna be really good at this one. In turn, okay. So you can tell that the enemy is is really open. And we're gonna capture Lisbao. Very nice, fifty medals. Very good. It's a really good start for this one. Easy mission. Let's see what what we're gonna have next. Uh, the third battle. Oh, maybe in Africa. Oh wait, sorry, sorry, sorry. Let's just go back. In Africa, right? We're gonna have a look at Africa. We're gonna have a look at Africa. So the third battles. Yes, at Africa, we're gonna defeat the French at Africa since they only have uh, some part left. Okay. So now to the giveaway so the giveaways i will be doing uh command and conquer red alert 3 uprising steam key giveaway yes this is a giveaway so yeah i'm doing this to celebrate the victory day in cambodia over the genocide so you guys can enter just answer a few questions which i will be posted in the uh, description down below also with some hashtag as well and don't forget to share this with you guys as well. So I hope you guys enjoy this. And yes, wish you guys good luck to win the giveaway. Uh, winner will be announced within a week. Okay, have a nice day. And I'll see you guys later.